this river was completely foreign to our crew. Oh, we're earning every single foot of this river. Down here in Texas, summer was in full swing. It was extremely hot outside, and it hadn't rained in quite a bit. Hey, is it time for another adventure already? Oh, it's time. Oh. All right, guys, as you can tell, we arrived and the sun has completely set, which means... <laughs> Why do we always do this to ourselves? We have to struggle to find camp. This is a new stretch of river, so we absolutely have no clue what's going on. I didn't drive all the way out here for an uneventful kayaking trip. Yeah, he's saying we're screwed and you guys are gonna enjoy watching our pain. Our first real challenge was taking on this river at night. It's known for having rapids and cut banks that you really have to navigate carefully. We got a rapid. Oh, oh my God, go left, go left. All right, we just hit the biggest rapid that we might even see all trip. But while we were dealing with that first challenge, the second one was almost simultaneous finding camp. I know there are spots, I just don't know how far down. It was near impossible to see suitable campsites in pitch black with nothing but our headlamps. But we were determined to get it done. Okay, so I would say after about an hour to an hour and a half's worth of paddling, we found a place that looks conducive to camping, so we just scoped it out. Looks like there's a bottom area for fire, cooking dinner, and setting up some tents. And then we also have these nice cypress trees that we're gonna hang our hammocks on. Look like tribesmen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Once we found a place that was suitable for camping, spirits were actually pretty high. We made quick work of setting up our hammocks, tents, and establishing a fire ring so that we could start cooking dinner and putting our burgers on the grill. And the rest of the night, we told stories and listened to the bats chirp and the cicadas screech. It was going to be a good night's rest for a very long day ahead of us. Scott. Good morning guys. It is the beginning of day two. The general consensus is that nobody slept well but nobody really slept bad if that makes kind of sense. Today we have no clue what to expect with this river. Last night we went over some rapids that kind of surprised us. All right time to pack up camp and get breakfast started so we can start our day. This thing's wearing up. The one where that guy like Everybody's taking a turn doing the coffee grinding. That's just what we do for fresh coffee out here on the river. <laughs> coffee is a staple on these trips. What better way to start your morning in the cool air than with something warm to go along with breakfast? Decadent, prestigious, just a touch of class. <laughs> Oh yeah, <laughs> so good when it hits the lips. Whew. Oh shit. <laughs> Slow down, brother. <laughs> Packing up and leaving camp is always bittersweet. You carve out this little piece of nature and call it home for 12 hours. But just when you're ready to spend a couple days there, it's time to head on out and explore the views hidden behind each turn in the river. Yeah. All right, Charlie just cooked up some breakfast tacos for the crew. First bite of the morning. Mmm, yeah, that's phenomenal. A little spice, a little kick to it. Ooh. All right, guys, we are pushing off from camp. Team is launching. Time to send some rapids. Just left camp and making our way down river for day two. All right, first little rapid corner of the day. This is beautiful. 
beautiful. Man, we're cruising, boy. Let me tell you about the trees and the seas, how it's all connected. Oh no! Oh. Oh. Dude, this is cool. Wow. Watching the sunset and the wind. Just some good old summer fun. Let's go, boys. Cheers, y'all. Cheers, boys. All right. <laughs> oh, no. Ah! Woo! Oh. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this section is known as the Spicewood Canyon, most notable for the massive cypress trees that line the banks, forming a cathedral over the river. It's reminiscent of the Redwood Forest out west in California, a forest of giants guiding us down river. Ooh, it's a skinny one. All right, guys, we've been crushing some miles. We've had a few spills in the rapids because they've gotten out of control. It is about that time for a little afternoon espresso break. So Charlie is going to treat us to a few shots of espresso and keep us moving down this river. I'm gonna master this thing, my efficiency's getting off. <laughs> I feel like you gotta get a little, you gotta get a little grab and push down to us. Just get everything happening all at once. Episode of one photograph. <laughs> <laughs> After a well-deserved rest and recharge, it was time to get back out into the canyon, but this canyon would soon change. We are approaching the shallows, right, here we go. aptly named for being high Perfect. effort and low mileage. It was going to get tough, guys. We had to make it past the shallows, which was several miles of grueling paddling in order to find camp before the sun went down. It was a race against the clock yet again. Last effort to keep an eye out for camp. We have no clue if there is one, but if there is, we'll find it. Our goal is to find camp before we reach the takeout point, which should be in the next couple of miles. So, running out of time to find a place. The sun sets quick down in that valley. Luckily, we had a lot of eyes in our crew, and they're apt for finding legal places to camp. We spotted one just as the sun disappeared. Good cheers. It was the final night, so we brought all of our cookware out, stoked the fire, and went to town on cooking up some burgers, sausages, and everything else you could imagine. Nights like these get remembered forever. Bam. Yep. Here we go. Oh, it's this not bad. Pan, pan grilled right here. Oh, it's ugly, but... It's a double. We got a double chi. Do. How is it? Give me a rating. The butter's delightful. That's what I'm saying. The butter's good. That replaces that sharp, but... Scale 110? It's an 8.5. Okay. Uh, yeah, easy. Okay. There too. 
that brioche, baby. Oh, it's consistent. I even got more mayonnaise on that bite. A5. Oh, that should take it there. Just a cool A5. Yeah, there you go. Ooh. That's a burger and bun. We're doing a, a bacon cheddar cheeseburger, fresh off the press from HEB, flame grilled, um, campfire style. I've never described a cheeseburger as crunchy. I've never done that. This is a crunchy cheeseburger, but it's not in a bad way, right? Because usually if it's crunchy, it's overcooked. For this one, the outside, this is crunchy. There's a nice char grill, but the inside is, it's perfect. Crunchy outside, perfect inside, with cheese everywhere. Cheese <laughs> everywhere. Good point. I'm going eight. I want to, yeah, we're doing eight. Eight? Eight. It's a good number. It's a good number. Yeah. Eight out of ten. Yeah? Yeah? Uh, that was good. Howdy, neighbor. Oh, How was morning. your slumber? Excellent. I slept pretty dang good. Here we were taking it slow during our final morning out on the Guadalupe River. There was a stillness throughout camp just as there always is on that last morning. We reflect back on the memories made and how we've grown as individuals, honing in our camping skills and taking advantage of being unplugged from society. Good morning guys, this is the beginning of day three of our trip. We all just woke up and we're kind of rummaging around, putting things away and just taking our time because it is absolutely beautiful outside. Beautiful, dude. It's unreal. Okay. Cool. We're never gone too long. We'll be back out in the wilderness very soon. Kind of just a, a memory I just had that I wanted to lock in. All the guys were going down a rapid with these cypress trees forming a cathedral over the river and I don't know, it just, it felt like a special moment because as we continue to age, these moments are fleeting. People have busy schedules and it just feels so cool to have a crew like this that we can come out here and send it. Simple, but it all makes sense. Thank you all for joining us on yet another episode. We'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.